Here we have question 11 from the pure maths paper. Show that the equation x squared minus 6x plus y squared minus 2y equals 6 represents a circle with center 3, 1. And you are also asked to find the radius of the circle. So our equation is x squared minus 6x plus y squared minus 2y equals 6. We're going to make this equation a perfect square. So I'm going to add half the coefficient of x all squared and I'm going to add half the coefficient of y all squared both sides. So we have x squared minus 6x so I'm adding half the coefficient of x all squared half the coefficient of x here is minus 3 all squared plus y squared minus 2y and I'm adding half the coefficient of y all squared it's minus 1 all squared and I need to do it both sides to keep the equation balanced so the coefficient of x all squared here is minus 3 all squared plus the coefficient of y all squared is minus 1 all squared Upon simplifying the right hand side, we can write x minus 3 all squared and we can write y minus 1 all squared and upon simplifying the right hand side we get 6 plus 3 times 3, that's 9, that's 15, 1 times 1, that's 1, so that's 16. So what we have is the equation of a circle and the general equation. So what we're going to do now is to compare this equation here wi with the general equation of a circle, which is x minus p all squared plus y minus q all squared equals r squared so they want you to find the radius of the circle therefore r squared would equal to 16 so to find the, the radius r squared equals 16 so the radius of the circle there is gonna be 4 Okay. Now, they want you to prove that the center of the circle is 3, 1 as well. So if you notice, P here, minus P here represents the center of the circle, which is denoted by the value of X. And also minus Q here represents the center of the circle as well. So you can write minus P would equal to minus 3. So P equals 3 and also minus Q equals to the minus 1 there. Therefore Q equals 1. So the coordinate of the center of the circle we know is as P Q which means that uh, which implies that the center of the circle is going to be 3, 1 and the radius is 4 so the question is answered so the radius of the circle is 4 and also the center is 3, 1 as required